Oh my god. Okay, feet for size reference. Look at these two piles of cat hair. Because we, well I say we, what I really mean is Sid, has shaved the cats once again for the summer months. You're right, Chaplin, you are looking mighty majestic. Not gonna lie, mate. Yes, you are. Don't know where Choji's gone, but he's also looking like a lion. So I'll show you him in uh, due time. As promised, here is chicken Choji. All his hair gone. And can I just say, they were angry when Sid was doing it, but they have been so happy all day yesterday and all night sleeping with us and just feeling so much like freer without all the fur because it was getting quite matted actually. Happy chappy. We are on the way to go and watch... Open! What are we watching? That, uh, Jurassic World. We're going to watch Jurassic... Open! What's open? Oh, it's open, yeah. Hannah's into reading all the signs now that she can read. Anyway, we're on open! the way... Open! <laughs> She's not uh, at the age where she can read the room, so... <laughs> I just got that. Yeah. We're on the way to watch open! Jurassic World! Yeah. So we'll review it open! open! <laughs> <laughs> we're on the way to watch Jurassic World and we'll review after open! but I just needed to open! welcome you guys open! <laughs> welcome you guys open! to open! 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 anyway we're gonna go to the movies and try and survive with two children and then we're gonna I just wanna I'm confused now because everything's again I'm wearing the green suit quick check in the middle of the car park. It's actually quite hot today as well. And these jeans are so incredibly tight, but it's okay. Get used to wearing tight clothes, Dina. Hannah's got the bag of snacks on her back. Bag is literally bigger than the child itself. So you definitely don't want to go back in to watch any more dinosaurs, do you? You're over it. Yeah. Hannah is done and dusted with the movies. Five minutes in, so we're here having ice cream, coffee and colouring. And I'm having a nice big drink. Mmm, delicious. Now Sid and Mika have come out early. Sid's so just over it. This reminds me of when we went to London and tried Kidzania with them. We took them to London like a few months ago, went to Kidzania, got loads of cool stuff and they just were not interested. It's only one o'clock and we're just like, this day is going to go so slowly. So over it. So they've got balloons and basically they're playing over there. We told them, listen, take the balloons, go down there, let me and Papa talk. <laughs> so in terms of the Jurassic Park review, can't really give one because I literally watched the first 30 seconds of the movie and then Hannah burst into tears and was like, this is too scary, get me out of here. So we took, went outside. Ha you watched what, nearly an hour, Sid? Not even, not even an hour? What, 45 minutes? Yeah. It looked like it was going to be a good movie, didn't it? Yeah, it is good. Sid literally looks so, so, this is the saddest you'll ever see Sid in a vlog. Oh. Yeah, he's literally so gutted. <laughs> this is the reality of parenthood. I and we went shopping. Yusuf and Lina are here from, uh, Yusuf and Lina are here visiting from wherever they live. <laughs> Basically, we went around all the charger shops we could find and then we ended up in TK Maxx and I ended up buying a bunch of stuff even though I was not planning on buying anything, to be honest with you. But I did, I bought loads of things. I'm gonna try it on, I haven't tried any of it on. Let me show you what I got first. Let me show you what I got. Look at this shirt, what do we think of this shirt? It's actually for girls, age 14. What do we think? I'm going to try this on first because it's the easiest one actually. Okay, what do we think of this shirt? I feel like it looks like it's for a 14 year old. Does it look like it's... Oh no, it looks alright. Oh, it looks quite nice this shirt. Yeah, I like it. Tuck it in, maybe not with these jeans. It's only £10. What do we think? Oh, I like the shirt and it's that nice... You know, is it called cheesecloth? It is, isn't it? You know when it's the, that thing? Oh yeah. Yes, and it's for a size 14 year old. Ten pound I got that for. What do we think, guys? I like it. Very nice for the summer. That is nice, isn't it? That's good for the summer. Wear it with nice black jeans. In fact, I'll put on the jeans that I bought and try it on with this. Okay, I've got these jeans on, right? Which are, I think they're Bershka, but they were in TK Maxx. But I don't know how I'm feeling about the leg. I feel like they need to be a bit longer, but maybe if I turn them up and wear them with like leggings. Not leggings, what? Sandals. Turn them up, wear them with sandals, maybe? Or just turn them up so they're cropped more. I like them. 
Hmm, these might be returned. Like the waist area is not fitting as nicely. But they're comfy, they are comfy. Okay, we don't know about these jeans, we'll see. But I like it with the shirt though. Sorry, they're not Bershka, they're actually Vera Moda. It's Vera Moda, that's why I bought them, because I was like, oh, they're Vera Moda, I like Vera Moda, but we'll see. Okay, now we have this pistachio top, but I like this. This is nice and lightweight for summer. It's got cute little pockets, but it's not fitting how I wanted with these jeans. I would have to tuck it, wouldn't I? It would be more. No, no, I can't. I need to find like a looser trouser maybe, or... But this is nice. I like it. This is, oh my God, this feels like I'm just wearing air. That is a nice top, that is. It's got quite a wide collar, which is a bit annoying. We'll see. But yeah, then we have this wondrous top. Oh my God, I actually really love this top, yeah. Okay, ignore the fact that I kept this pistachio top underneath, but obviously I had to put something on underneath to show you guys this cute little knitted kicker's vest. I like it. So my plan is to wear it with maybe a white shirt, like a fitted white shirt kind of underneath, and then just like either these black jeans or other denim jeans or just other trousers. What do we think of this one, Lena? Do you like it? I like it. Yeah, if this top underneath actually had like buttons and like could open up, yeah. it'd probably look all right. That's actually cute, I like that. Okay, this little vest is staying, which is different for me. I never ever go for anything like this, but I think it's cute. Do you know what? I should be wearing it with white trousers or cream trousers. Yes. Cream trousers, cream shirt, we'll yes, try it like that. Okay, this is not for everyone, this shiny white tissue, <laughs> but it's an Adidas shiny windbreaker. No, it's Vibes. No, this is Vibes. I like this and I would wear this with my Blue H&M leggings that we both have. Yeah. And then like sports socks and trainers. Yeah. Lena Sorry. doesn't like this print over here, which is actually not flowery, it's actually camo. Yeah, actually it really is flowery. Okay. To be honest with you, I don't like the print either. I actually don't like okay. the print. But I sacrificed that for the overall fit. So this is a size 14, but what I like about it, obviously you've got this half zip like this, but then you also have the drawstring here, which vibes. We both love to do this, Lena. Yes. We both love to like do that. Um, that is vibes. No, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling this. This was £35 though, so not really as cheap as like most other things in TK Maxx, but worth it. This is the kind of thing I'll keep in my wardrobe for a long time, I think. Mm -hmm. And I'd skip outside with it in the garden or wind break. And it's actually really, it's not hot, so it's good for the summer. Keeping it. Okay, now we have a new gym top from TK Maxx Sports Menswear. This is like an Adidas. It's the Aero Ready collection. Running top, I'm guessing. The sleeves don't have thumb holes, so that's kind of annoying, just elasticated. But it's kind of like medium weight, so it is okay for the gym. You might get too hot, but I'm kind of used to that, and if I get boiling, I just kind of do that a little bit. I got this in a size large, so it's covering my booty, and at the gym, I will just wear this with my Adidas leggings and my, like, Adidas boots when I'm skipping. And yeah, but this is good for the gym. Oh, I would actually just wear it with black jeans. What a vibe. I love this kind of thing, just Sports top and jeans, like, you know, keeping it. Okay, here we have another large t-shirt. I don't know what the brand is, but I actually just bought this for the gym to wear with black leggings because I love gym tops that have a nice big print on the back. I think it's so fun. I don't know about the front. I don't like what's on the front. That's disgusting. But it's it's not, the back. No, it's not disgusting, but I don't like how it's so square. But I like the back. But it's fine. It's literally just for the gym, so. It's like literally gonna be gym and pajamas. Okay. That's everything I got, got from TK Maxx. And then I managed to find one really cool thing from the charity shop, look at this. Which is my favorite. It's not um, really in season, but it was like six pound in the charity shop. So I like, I had to get it. And I can tell that it's some sort of Turkish brand. I can see that. And basically what it is, is I've got a pair of jeans that are exactly this denim. What do we think? Oh, I love this so much. Wait, what if this a dress? Well, yeah, probably. It's like this, isn't it? What a vibe. Oh, what? Yeah. That is... Is there pockets? There's no pockets, unfortunately. But the cut is literally the best thing since sliced bread. If I wear matching jeans and then just chunky shoes and then just like a tight white top underneath. Vibes. Quite lightweight as well, not too... Oh my god, I love it because it's got a little flare as well. So this is probably the best thing I bought today and it was from the charity shop and it was £6. It was from Islamic Relief. The Islamic Relief charity shop. And the brand is 100% a Turkish one because I can just tell. When I went to Istanbul and I did shopping, like, they just had the best fit clothes ever. I'll show you here in this light. Yeah. Best thing ever. 100%. So, oh my God, I'm actually keeping everything. Well, 
I'm actually happy with everything. Oh, except for the jeans, maybe. We'll see about the jeans. But the more I'm wearing them around the house, the more comfy they are, but... Lena's gonna try them on. If Lena likes them, you're having them in it, Lena. <sighs> really, actually, do you actually want them if they fit you? Yeah. Do you really? I love jeans like that. But they'll be, that. they'll be quite cropped on you. Okay, guys, Lena... I'm obviously not standing like this. All right. <laughs> Lena tried on the jeans and they actually look way better on her than they do on me. And... Lena, you didn't tell them what you bought from the charity shop today. I have to try it. No, what from the charity shop, bro? Your what jacket. Is this? The one you're you're wearing it. Are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm wearing it. <laughs> I'm wearing the jacket. Yeah. So she actually bought this from the charity shop today, and then when she tried on those Vera Moda jeans, they literally match perfect. So they are match perfect. Yeah, they look and it actually looks so nice with your t-shirt and jewelry there. I think that, that looks so cute. That's a good outfit then. Yeah, it's a sick outfit. Okay. So and then the pink socks. And the pink socks. Super cute. Yes. Love it. <laughs> Yusuf hates it, but you know what we, what me and Lena said? When the man doesn't like the outfit, it means the outfit is lovely. Yes. Ain't that the truth? It is the truth. <laughs> okay, bye. Guys, it's the next day and I've styled out the kicker's jumper. And I've realised it actually needs to be a bit smaller. If It would be, be great if it was like really tight, but whatever. It'll do. I think it looks really, I think it looks really nice. And I styled it with some old black jeans that I have. Yeah, I think. Actually, I really like it. I really like it. Here we go. Actually, I've wanted to do like a vest kind of over shirt for a while, but I've never found one that I like. But I like this one, so it's working. I'm taking Hannah to a birthday party and then we're going to my mum's house for brunch. But I won't film any of that. Ha 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 ha. Sorry, just imagine it. Guys, guess what? <gasps> guess what? There's boobs in the office. Look at this. Hannah made it for me for my birthday. Is it the right way? Yes, it is. There are the nipples. Um, because Hannah has her own business and it's called Sun and Palm that you started in lockdown, didn't you, Hannah? This is actually gonna go in my dressing room in my, in my house, but it's here for now because I got it today. Did you start it in lockdown? Yeah. She started in lockdown and she makes cool earrings and cool wall hangings. You should check it out. I'll leave the link in the description. <laughs> yeah. If you have a, show us your Instagram quickly, because the Instagram for it is so aesthetically pleasing, to be honest with you. And I'm like, why aren't you making my Instagram look like that? <laughs> look, scroll, scroll. Look how cute, how cute are those earrings? Look at those, look at the earrings, look. Keep going, keep going. Where's, oh, look at these boobies. But then, look at those boobies. <laughs> look at the mirror, look at the mirrors. Yes, open it up. So she makes loads of things and it can be on request, can't it, Hannah? Look at the bag, I love it. So um, you can message Hannah on Instagram if you want to like make something specific or whatever, whatever. She can make it for you because she's really good. She's really good at it. <laughs> she's like really good. Look at that, so nice. Also on a palm, check it out, yeah. Thank you, Hannah. Thank you. Anyway, guys, look what I brought into the office. I bought some weights that I don't need at home. Got a 16 kg. Hannah, this kettlebell's really fancy, mate. It's really, whoa, it feels heavy today. And we are going to have an office workout. So I'll film it for you guys, but it's not like a join in thing. I'm literally just filming it for vlog purposes. So let's do it. Hannah, we haven't worked out together in ages. We always used to work out in the office, me and Hannah. We go to the gym at lunchtime a few times, but we haven't done it in months. We haven't done it since before Christmas, actually. So we're going to do it right now. Let's go.
Guys, we finished that workout. Basically what you saw, we just did four rounds. Four rounds with a swing finisher at the end and then we just did some skipping to warm up. So it wasn't a major workout, but we just, you know, got just got something done. Do you know what I'm saying? So yeah. Oh yeah, I also came on here just to end the vlog actually. Um, but first, for lunch, what are we having? I'm having vegan bangers and mash from r &S Meals. You guys know I get these weekly um, and I use them for lunch or sometimes dinner. And I have a code, which is DINA20, to get 20% off your first order if you haven't already tried. I'll leave the link. And also, then I'm gonna have a full fill. Chocolate hazelnut whip flavor. And I actually buy these in a box of 12 from Amazon. So it's on my Amazon store if you want. But anyway, that's it. That's the end of this vlog. What do you want in the next one? I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>